nearly flattened because of a simple bump. Many spanks. Glanks. Thanks, sir. I'll finish stacking these stasis pods immediately. Fix it. Didn't I ask you and Sideswipe to work on this together? Well, yes, sir, but Sideswipe's stabilizer is sore, so he thought it might be better if I did it myself. Spit down. <sighs> you know, I think Sideswipe might be taking advantage of you. Oh, hardly, sir. Sideswipe offered to cover my elephant cage cleaning duties for the next five cycles. Fair trade. No, fix it. We don't have any elephants. Oh. Then what have I been cleaning? Sideswipe. <laughs> Sideswipe! Ah, audio overload! You need to stop taking advantage of your teammates and you... What are you listening to, anyway? Oh, I love this song! <laughs> Again. Uh. <clears throat> yeah, well, the music on this planet is pretty great. The melodies are complex, and the lyrics frequently have multiple meanings. I like the mm -hmm 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 parts. Yeah. Well, in any case, look, we need to help our teammates, okay? We don't get the better of them. Customer! <laughs> Give us what we desire. Or the Cuspigo shall destroy you all! Caspigo? Local legend. Some kind of giant, cranky, elk-like creature walks on two legs and has the strength of a thousand humans, right? I, too, thought the Caspigo was but a myth. Until I saw it. The Caspigo said... I need stuff, and you's going to get it for me. Or else I'm going to break some junk. And by junk, I mean... Use. I shared the story with others. They came to witness the Cuspigo, and now they too are believers. We must all follow the Cuspigo's commands, or... Uh-huh. And will the Cuspigo be paying cash? Oh, no. Arnold will. Uh, that's me. <laughs> then what can we get for you and the Cuspigo, Arnie? We have already found many things, but the Caspigo still demands 15 pounds of soldering lead, 441 two-inch nails, 37 yards of steel cable, and one high-voltage electrical generator. Eh. Okay, just uh, stay here, and we'll see what we can find for you. 14 relay switches. Russell, don't give them the generator. I'll explain later. Well, here's most everything. Give me a minute to fire up the crane and... I'll bring a generator over. Dad, we sold the last generator yesterday, remember? What? We have one in the back. And no, we sold it to Mr. Bumblebee. Oh. Sorry. The only other high-capacity generator in the area is at the dam. Well, that's not for sale. The Caspigo will not be pleased. He may very well kebab us on his antlers. <laughs> Off we go! Boy, is somebody taking those poor saps for a ride, pretending to be the Cospigo. <laughs> uh, so why couldn't I sell him a generator? Oh, because, Denny, I suspect. I'm back, Lieutenant. But the mission was a complete failure. I didn't find anything at the crash site that we hadn't seen previously, except this.
Well, this thing won't be bothering us anymore. Wow, I bet that could totally take down a Decepticon. What is it? It's a Decepticon hunter. Sideswipe, how is your stabilizer feeling? Um, fix it? A little more info? Oh, right, a uh, Sideswipe damaged his stabilizer, so I... On the Decepticon hunter? What? We have a Decepticon hunter? Where? A Decepticon hunter! <laughs> Careful! It can be quite dangerous. Decepticon hunters were standard issue on all prison ships. What's it do? The Decepticon Hunter connects to its user's neurotransmissions, so whatever combat device is imagined, the Decepticon Hunter generates within certain parameters. That doesn't sound dangerous. It sounds awesome! Protoblasters! Yeah. <laughs> I said... Protoblasters! Hey! <laughs> Protoblaster! Whoa! I must be doing it wrong. That's because it's tied to your thought process. You actually have to be able to think to make it work. You're lucky I'm able to think about sunshine and rainbows right now. Before anyone thinks something they'll regret. So why couldn't I offload the generator, B? I could have used the space to display my vintage refrigerators. My poor, poor refrigerators. That list from the Cospigo. Those items may have seemed random, but they weren't. I suspect the Cospigo is one of our Decepticons tricking humans into thinking it's your creature of legend, using them to help jury rig a space bridge. A space bridge? So we could go home to gather reinforcements. Home or anywhere else. We could, if we thought this space bridge would work, but it's far more likely that the slightest misalignment of the components will create a black hole-like phenomenon that could badly damage or even destroy Earth. <gasps> Which would be bad. The Alchemorse Prisoner Manifest does list a Decepticon named Thunderhoof matching the general description. We better make sure the generator at the dam stays where it is. Roger that. Autobots! Here comes another stinker. Nope. This time, he nails it. Let's rev rock and rumble! Oh, really? I kind of like that one. Sideswipe, you and Grimlock stay here and guard the generator. Strong arm, let's make a circular sweep of the area. Scout the perimeter. Bumblebee told us to stay here. Yeah, but here includes right here and the perimeter around right here. Oh. Side squad. <laughs> Doing that? Why are you here and not with Grimlock? A uh, funny story. I. Who's there? What are you? Those antler heads took out Grimlock? No, it had to be the Decepticon, who might not have attempted an attack if there had been two guards on duty like I ordered. Ugh. Ugh. Grimlock, 
Are you all right? <laughs> of course I am. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, are my arms and legs still attached? Did you see what hit you? All I saw were horns coming at me. You know that feeling when something throws you through a mountain? No. Yes. Well, it was like that. Only painful. Err. Grimlock, head back to the scrapyard and have Fix It take a look at you. Okie dokie. Yeah, you can't fly, pal. Strong arm, help him back. Me? After what, Sideswipe? Grimlock can't make it back on his own, and I obviously can't trust Sideswipe to take responsibility for anyone or anything. Oh, come on! Call if you need help. Since when can't I fly? We're down two team members against an enemy strong enough to knock Grimlock silly. I know I messed up, okay? Look, I can't be wondering how to contain targets and my own team members, Sideswipe. I said I know. Space Bridge. Think you can play it straight long enough to help me keep them from using it, Sideswipe? Ah. We can deal with the Decepticon later, but we can't just roll in and let those humans see us. I have a plan. Just trust me, okay? Oh. No, blue to blue, red to red. If we don't build this altar precisely the way the Caspigo ordered, well, you know what it'll do to us. There are other legendary creatures of great legendariness that walk the forest, such as me, Sideswingo. And me, Bumbigo. We've never heard of you. Just because you don't know us doesn't mean we're not legends. <laughs> the Caspigo has been a very naughty creature. Criminal, in fact. He has acted against our wishes and shall be punished, so, Unless you want a piece of us, you'd better leave here, now. Or this will happen. Why do legendary creatures hate trees so much? Not bad, huh? One not bad doesn't make everything else good. And we're not out of the woods yet. What's going on here? Where'd all my little worker weirdos run off to? You're under arrest. Don't go barking rules and regulations at me, officer. I'm Thunderhoof, see? I ran some of the biggest criminal enterprises on Cybertron. Half you cops were on my payroll. That space bridge is dangerously unstable. What's unstable is you if you think I ain't bridging the Cybertron to take back my turf. Tell you what, seeing as your fellow Cybertronians and all, if you help me, I'll cut you in on a piece of the action. You are going back to Cybertron, Thunderhoof. In a stasis pod. B, maybe we should think about this. It's not like we have a space bridge. Maybe his will work, and we don't want to stay on Earth forever, do we? Sideswipe. We don't make deals with criminals. You're coming with us. Hey, oh, where's the respect? Usually. I let underlings do the dirty work, but that don't mean I don't remember how to do it myself. Sideswipe, a hand. You mess with the boss, you get the hook! Thunderhoof, wait! Huh? Bumblebee's not worth it. 
What? I'm sick of that bot telling me what to do, then telling me everything I do is wrong. I want off this bot forsaken planet. What? Oh, finally someone with a little intelligence. Come on, kid, let's do the Autobot stomp. Seriously, don't waste your time. He can't stop you. Just leave B here to rot on this mud ball with no way home. Would serve him right. Okay, let's go. Wait, Thunderhoof, we should check the connections in this space bridge before we... Hey, you're we, uh... a smart kid, but don't tell me my business. I got an empire to get home to. But... Kid, and I mean what I says. You had me worried there for a minute, Sideswipe. Dude, I'm on the team. But I can kind of see how it doesn't always seem like it. The space bridge wasn't stable. But when Thunderhoof disappeared, it sure looked like a teleportation. So where did he go? Cybertron? Ah, I'm still stuck on this backwater planet. Fine, I'll just set up a new empire here. 
Eh, I get those crackpot locals to help. They bought it once, they'll buy it again. Ah, yo! Sorry about the pain. It's temporary, and you'll soon come to understand. Necessary. In the meantime, you want to remain free? You stay with me. I'm Steeljaw. This better not be a trick. I've had enough of tricks lately. <laughs> Side swingo, bumbigo, we look to you for guidance. And for the last time, Morton, watch it with the sacred girdle! <laughs>